Hello. Today we are going to be tying an elk hair caddis. Like this. The elk hair caddis is probably one of the best dry flies there is around. The hook I'm going to be using is a Temico 100 dry fly size 10 for visual purposes. Secure your hook in the vise. Thread I'm going to be using is uni thread, eight aught. Going to attach your thread, clip the tag in. Go to the butt. Now for our ribbing, we're going to use brass ultra wire, size small. You're going to need two to three inches depending on the size of your fly. I'm going to tie that in. Now the dubbing we're using is hand blended rabbit body dark brown. I do this myself. Apply your dubbing wax. Apply your dubbing. Make a nice slim rope. And let the wrapping begin. More dubbing wax. Now, there's the end of the dubbing. I'm going to tie in our hackle. I'm using a brown neck hackle, tie-in hackle. I'm using hackle pliers because this hackle is so short, it's very hard to manipulate with your fingers. I'm going to make nice evenly spaced wraps. Now you're going to take your wire, wrap it over the end. Release the hackle pliers, and you're going to wiggle that wire back and forth to weave through the hackle so that you don't trap any of the fibers between the dubbing. And the wire. Now you're going to tie off the wire. Hold that tight. Snip it off. You're going to take your wing. I've already pre stacked mine, but you're going to want to take clump that's about the gape of the hook. You're gonna pat and you're gonna stack it in a hair stacker so the tips look even like this. Now my wing needs to be a little bit bigger, so I'm going to stack another wing.
go. The butt ends are about the gape of the hook. Now I'm going to stack that. Pinch the ends. Stroke away the under fibers. There go. Nice even wing. Now you want the wing to be about as long as the body of the fly. So the butts of the hair are going to the tips of the hair will be about here. Pinch that, make a soft loop, and then tight. There we go. Take your scissors, snip. Ah, got ya. up a little bit of a thread head. Whip finish. I prefer to use my fingers, but some people like using the little handy tools. They're handy, but they break after a couple of weeks. Snip off the thread. varnish and there you go an Elk Care Cats thanks for watching